dancing in the rain You never mind a cloudy day You make the world a better place I turned her in difficult situations as so many of her friends do to get an unfiltered take Besides her brutal honesty, the other quality that came up repeatedly when I asked Abby's closest friends to share their favorite thing about her is that she's always herself. She never tries to act like anybody else. You do things other people don't. You make sure no one feels alone. You love talking on the phone. out with John, you are guaranteed to have a good time. Whether you're knocking around the squash ball or being forced to watch eight minute YouTube videos on his iPhone, laughing is always an integral part of hanging out with John. You love riding on the train. You'd rather life not be Riding on a train complement each other's strengths and weaknesses, but are also similar where it counts. They have the same values, vision for the future, and a readiness to laugh at themselves. You know, so you, you add these people to your, to your life, and then I look at weddings as the beginning of a new family, and I see that here. Don't know. Loving family, dear, dear friends. It makes me think of an old song by the Twilights, Sea of Love. To some of us, it's just an old, sweet song. I think it perfectly describes the folks assembled here today to see the marriage of Abigail and Jonathan. Sea of Love, come with me to the sea, to the sea of love. We gather here today with joy in our hearts. We want to tell you, Abby and John, how much we love you. I, Jonathan, take you, Abigail, to be my wife. I, Abigail, take you, Jonathan, to be my husband. To have and to hold from this day forward. For better or for worse. For richer or for poorer. In sickness and in health. To love and to cherish until death do us part. <laughs> to love and to cherish until death do us part. Jonathan, do you take this woman to be your wife? I do. <laughs> Abigail, do you take this man to be your husband? I do. For this gathering of friends and family, by the power granted me by the great state of Maine, I pronounce you husband and wife. Break that glass. Hey! Right. Yeah, you kissed that right. Abby and John are the definition of two peas in a pod. Their compatibility is amazing. You have constant fun together, partake in super weird diets together, and are obviously very deeply in love.
They are both total wackos in the best way possible. I've never seen two people have so much fun together and accept the other so wholeheartedly. They keep each other perfectly balanced. Abby and John, in each other you have truly found your better half. On this absolutely incredible day filled with what feels like unprecedented love and happiness, it's amazing to think that the best days are yet to come. I can't wait to be there for each and every one of them. To raise a glass and toast the new Mr. and Mrs. Hall. daughter who is the most exquisite bride I have ever seen and her incredibly handsome groom who I think is truly the sweetest man and I could not be happier that he is now part of our family.